And of course, we are waiting for the latest SpaceX launch uh, happening shortly. The countdown, the launch of a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket from Cape Canaveral Air Force Station in Florida with the U.S. Air Force's GPS-3 SB-4 navigation satellite. So we've got 20 seconds to go until uh, we see that launch there. All set to take off at the beginning of October, but that was scrubbed. That looks like this is taking place now. Pitching downrange. Stage one propulsion is nominal. Thirty seconds into flight, propulsion says the Merlin 1B engines are nominal. We're on trajectory and preparing to throttle down in preparation for maximum dynamic pressure. And we're heading into the throttle bucket as we power down the Merlin engines. And throttling back up now. And when the engine's back up at full power. Supersonic. And we have gone past Mach 1. Waiting now for Max Q call out. The vehicle is experiencing maximum aerodynamic pressure. Guidance engineer reports we're passing through the period of maximum aerodynamic pressure called max Q. From here on, as the speed picks up, the atmospheric density decreases and the loads are reduced on the Falcon 9 vehicle. Propulsion power continues to look good. The trajectory looks good. MVAC engine chill started. The engine chill in call out on the MVAC second stage engine indicates we've begun chilling that turbo pump like we did with the first stage engines, getting ready for ignition of the upper stage engine. Now coming up in just over 30 seconds, the usual three sequence event that'll happen in rapid succession. Main engine cutoff will shut down the nine Merlin 1D engines. You can see glowing there in the night sky. Stage separation, and then we'll get startup of the second stage engine. Nice view from the ground camera looking up at the nine Merlin 1D engines on the business end of the Falcon 9 first stage. Stage separation confirmed. You've been watching yeah, the launch of Falcon 9 by SpaceX. We'll be watching closely for Falcon 9's first stage to also land on the company's drone ship in the Atlantic Ocean.